This is a relaxation for managing pain. Begin by finding a comfortable place to sit and relax and by uncrossing your arms and your legs and sitting instead of lying down you will be able to stay awake and that's what meditation is about not necessarily going to sleep. To begin to start relaxing and beginning deep breaths. We'll count for an inhale, count of four, in, hold for a count of four, and an exhale for a long count of eight. And as you breathe in, have your abdomen go out, breathing from your belly. Begin with breathing in, two, three, four, and hold, two, three, four, exhale, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Breathe in, two, three, four, and hold, two, three, four, exhale, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Breathe in, two, three, four, and hold, two, three, four, and exhale, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Slowing down, breathing in. Three, four, and hold. Two, three, four, exhale. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Last one, breathe in. Two, three, four, and hold. Two, three, four, exhale. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Continue deep breathing, but don't really give it much mindful attention. Your body will have established a rhythm by now, and you'll be able to just have a long exhale, and you'll have a nice, even rhythm to your breath. You'll be creating an experience and being able to learn and discover your potential within you for controlling your own body and your own pain, and your own mind, and even your own emotion. In sitting in a chair right now, you'll be able to avoid falling asleep and be able to stay in meditation. Meditation is about not sleeping, but a deep physical relaxation coupled with increased self-awareness. Getting comfortable now. Be mindful of your body. You are ready to begin. Begin this exercise by closing your eyes, by scanning your body, and anywhere that you are uncomfortable or unsettled, you can simply choose to readjust, essentially become more comfortable. With your eyes closed, you can scan any muscles of the body for any place where you might be holding any obvious tension for the day. If you notice tension in your brow or shoulders or your back, release that tension now and let those muscles relax. Now bring your attention to your breath. Again, as you breathe in and breathe out, notice your chest and belly rise and fall with each breath. Notice the tempo and the quality of the breath. And if you need to adjust for comfort at any point, to breathe more comfortably, it's perfectly okay to do that. And if any time during this session you need to scratch an itch or just for comfort, it won't disturb you. In fact, it'll just help you to become more relaxed as you become more comfortable. Now breathing is about the only thing we do from the beginning of our life until the end of our life. What's interesting is that how most of us never really think about breathing or our breath. And as you breathe in and breathe out, focus on your breath. Noting what it feels like to have the breath drawing in through your nostrils. And noting that point where the in-breath turns around in your lungs and becomes an exhale. You don't really need to try to speed up or slow down your breath. Just pay attention to it. Breathing in and breathing out. 
by focusing on the breath, you're able to focus inward, putting aside any of the distractions of the day or the world, or even the room around you or outside, and to better your, take a few minutes to just better your life and learn something new. I want to take the next few minutes to guide you through this relaxation experience. First, we're going to focus on relaxing the body and then the mind. During this process, you might find your mind wandering or thinking, and that's perfectly okay. Certainly does not mean that you cannot experience this meditation and the benefits, because that's exactly what minds do. They think and sometimes wander. But if you should find yourself being distracted by this, either outside of the room distractions or your own thoughts, you can simply return to focus on the focus point of your breath. When you pay attention to your breath, you'll find how easy it is to renew your focus by just observing your breath and focusing on you. We often carry tension of the day in our brow, around the eyes, the little muscles of the face. Pay attention to those muscles now, especially those muscles in the brow and around the eyes, and let them relax, releasing any tension that you might hold. Notice also but that by unclenching your jaw, you can relax the muscles of the cheek and the chin. And although very simple to do, this simple little exercise, relaxing the muscles in the face, goes a long way to helping you to release any tension in your busy or stressful day. Now if you're sitting in a desk chair, an armchair, rather than a recliner or a similar type of chair, you can relax the tension in your neck and shoulders by just letting your chin drop towards your chest, taking the weight of your head off of your shoulders and your neck, noticing how the muscles become loose and limp and elongated and relaxed. Of course, if you're in a recliner or a similar type of chair, and your head is supported by a pillow or the back of the chair, this is unnecessary but you can still relax those muscles in the shoulders and the neck by just allowing the natural heaviness of relaxation to flow through those muscles in the upper body. Finding it quite comfortable to take a few minutes to yourself and practice meditation. Practice something new. And now let the experience of relaxation extend through your arms in your upper arms and forearms, noticing the natural heaviness of the arms that relaxation brings. As you extend the sensation of relaxation into your hands, notice the feeling of heaviness of your palms and your fingers as you let each muscle release any tension that might remain. As you continue to relax, note your breath, smooth and rhythmic, each breath bringing with it a healing sensation of relaxation. Notice how the breath has naturally become calm and relaxed, and now the muscles of your back and chest can relax with each breath. As you extend the sensation of awareness of relaxation into the muscles of the buttocks and thighs, sense the feeling of heaviness that relaxation brings. Relaxing now the muscles of the lower legs, the calves, the shins, and the ankles. Feeling any remaining tension leaving the body as even the toes relax. In fact, you can even wiggle your toes or open the toes, letting even the tiny little muscles in each toe relax. 
Now notice how relaxation feels. Notice that it feels calm and not tense, peaceful, rest, heavy, not light. Relaxation with each breath is calm and smooth and rhythmic. And notice your regular heartbeat, smooth and rhythmic. How even without any effort or even thinking about it, your heartbeat has become calm and regular, smooth and rhythmic. You've done a great job of relaxing up until this point, creating a sensation of relaxation and a sensation of relaxation, of heaviness, and the feeling of calm. As easy as, easy as it is to create these sensation, you can use these skills to create other feelings and sensations. Notice your eyelids. Each eyelid is controlled by tiny little micro muscles that open and close many times throughout each day. But notice how good it feels to relax those tiny little eyelid muscles and allow them to relax and letting them become most relaxed and heavy. Notice your hands. How good it feels just to let them relax on your lap, heavy and relaxed. And how the feet and toes feel when they're totally relaxed, heavy and comfortable. And as easy as you can relax the body, you can also relax the mind. Until this point, we've been focusing on the physical relaxation. And you may have found your mind wandering or thinking. When this happened, did you focus on your breath? Using it as a point to bring your attention inward when you noted your, noticed your mind wandering. To fully relax the mind, just focus on the breath, setting aside anything, either known or unknown, keeping you from fully benefiting from this experience. With each breath, notice how wonderful it feels to set aside the tasks of the day and spend some time increasing your self-awareness. With each breath, Double the sensation of relaxation, letting each breath take you into a deeper state of creativity and more profound awareness of your internal experience. Never asleep, but deeply relaxed. Each breath, in and out. Each breath, smooth and rhythmic. Now bring your attention to your hands. You created a feeling of sensation of heaviness in them by relaxing and letting yourself experience this meditation process. And although both hands are present on your lap, each one is different. Perhaps your conscious mind is aware of the differences between the two hands. One might feel heavier or more relaxed in one or the other. Perhaps one feels lighter or simply different than the other. You can try to discern the difference with your conscious mind if you'd like to. Or you can stop trying to figure it out and just allow your subconscious mind guide you, leading automatically and knowing automatically that maybe the left one is the one that you are attracted to, finding it the right choice for you. Or perhaps you're drawn to the right hand, finding that by choosing that one that, that there's only one left. Of course, either way is fine. 
and even if you don't yet, notice the difference. Simply decide which hand will remain relaxed in your lap and which hand, which hand will be doing the work of this exercise. With a hand that you'll be doing the work, lift that hand and use the index finger to point to a spot on the back of the resting hand. Go ahead and touch the back of that hand with your working hand. And simply use your index finger to tap several times in the same spot on the back of the passive hand. Tap that same spot several times. Tap, 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 tap. And notice the sensation of being lightly tapped by one hand on the back of the other hand. Now return that working hand back to its resting place and let both hands rest. But continue to pay attention to the spot on the back of the passive hand where the feeling or sensation of being tapped was present. Now place the size of your finger step or about the size of a dime where you are tapping. Use the creative part of your mind to experience the sensation of no sensation in that very spot where you were tapping. As easy as you can relax your muscles or create heaviness or regulate your own heartbeat, you can allow yourself to become aware of the sensation of no sensation in this small spot about the size of a dime on the back of your hand. And now imagine the size of that place where that sensation of no sensation is present to become a little larger, expanding to the size of a nickel and now a quarter resting on the back of your hand. Continue to let that awareness of the sensation of no sensation to become larger, expanding to the size of an old half dollar or silver dollar and feeling the fingers and the palms and sensing the sensation of no sensation in that place of the back of your hand about the size of a silver dollar. Certainly remarkable how the creative part of the mind can focus on something that perhaps we've overlooked before that being our capacity to focus on the absence of sensation, or you'll call the sensation of no sensation, no sensation at all. And now yourself to allow yourself to aware this, ex to extend the sensation of no sensation to the entire back of your hand. Noting that like the relaxation that we started in our brow, but eventually was experienced in all of your limbs and fingers. The sensation of no sensation can travel through each finger, engulfing your entire hand in a comfortable awareness of the sensation of no sensation in that hand. No longer feeling heavy or light, no longer aware of anything in that hand except the sensation of no sensation over your entire hand as if, as if it was a glove of new awareness. It feels wonderful to create this awareness, doesn't it? And now you can actually use that arm to move that anesthetized hand and move your hand to any part of your body where you would like to transfer this awareness. You could simply move it to the top of the other hand, or touch your knee, or your temple, 
or your back or your other elbow or even to a place in your jaw that felt uncomfortable anywhere in the body where there's pain or stress noting that just by simply moving your hand and touching this other place in your body the awareness of the sensation of no sensation easily transfers to this place that you're touching. Now move your arm and your hand back to where it began. Resting on your lap. Noting this awareness of the sensation. Or rather the awareness of the absence of sensation. Both in your hand and on the place or places that you've touched. Of course, none of these experiences of awarenesses that you have created today come from me, or but rather from that place inside of your awareness that regulates your own experiences. What this means, of course, is that anytime, anywhere, that you can pay attention to your breath, to a state of relaxation and then even to the sensation of no sensation anywhere in your body and you can use this to change the way you feel anytime you need of course by touching a part of the body that's stressed or pain you can find relief but the same process can be applied to emotional pain or dis discomfort if at any time that you feel your heart or spirit is hurt, you can even create a protective sensation of no sensation in this place, the heart, the solar plexus of the spirit, giving yourself time to begin an emotional healing, an ability to manage emotions or feelings that previously might have been too painful. And over the next few days or weeks, revisit this exercise several times to practice the process of increasing your awareness, not only of discomfort, but also comfort and altering perceptions and experiencing new things and even the sensation of no sensation. It is time now to reorient to the time and place in the room around you. Pay attention to your hands, both of them relaxing. Notice the sense of lightness in both of them. Notice how that light lightness in the feet and the sensation of lightness in the eyelids. Of course you know you can open your eyes right now if you wanted to. But wait just a moment, continuing to enjoy this state of creativity, relaxation, and meditation that you have created in a moment, ready to return to a vibrant and energetic you, empowered by new learning. And now I'm going to count from one to three with each number becoming more alert and awake, ready to experience the rest of the day. One, taking a deep breath, letting oxygen reach every cell of your body. Two, choosing to retain the sensation of comfort in your body, mind and spirit while stretching out any muscles that need to be stretched. Three, feeling fantastic opening your eyes, ready to use these new learnings in each and every way and each and every day in a way that's truly beneficial to you. Make a decision now that you want to practice meditation, more relaxation, more control. Notice the areas that you 
Touch while in the meditation, remain peaceful and calm and at rest with either no pain at all or a l less pain than they were before, either no stress at all or less stress than they were. Know that you can, as you created it in that relaxation state, that you can retain it in other states. And even now, if you want to dismiss more pain or more stress, you can go right back into this relaxed state. Experience the process again and remove pain. Enjoy your day.